Hello, hello everybody. Ooh, just turning my sound up. Well, I hope you can see me. I'm a little far away from everybody at the minute. Ooh, let's come a little nearer. Good morning, good afternoon even. It's Sunday afternoon, it's VE day. <laughs> And welcome to VE Day Afternoon Tea. I've got a beautiful homemade trifle. I've got a Victorian sponge cake with raspberry jam, cream, and it's actually made from wholemeal flour. It's not a chocolate one, it's because it's made from wholemeal flour. That's why it looks like it does. So welcome to Afternoon Tea. I've got my red and white polka dot dress on. And I can't wait to try some beautiful tea. I've got my very nice teapot. I've got my beautiful little teacup. And a beautiful little spoon. I may have to bring this slightly nearer because I can't see the writing. <laughs> You're thinking, how many times has she done this? Quite a lot. I think that's a bit of raspberry jam on the stool. Are we straight? We look a bit not level. <laughs> oh, I think that's a little bit better, isn't it? There we are. Oh my goodness, wonderful. Well, thanks very much for joining me today. Afternoon tea, welcome. Yes, yeah, usually on my channel I am. There's usually just me. So what am I going to have with my afternoon tea? I've got this lovely little dish for this little glass to have a go with this trifle. Now, if you don't know what an English trifle is, it's a great way of using anything left over you've got sweet in your fridge. But you start off with a sponge layer and it's a sponge bottom to it. This bit at the bottom, bottom part is all sponge. Then I spread on the sponge some raspberry jam and then on top of the raspberry jam I placed a lot of raspberries and then I added a little sherry just to give it a zing made some jelly poured that over the top let it all set made some custard poured the custard so it's layer after layer after layer that's how a trifle works you can put as much or as little sherry as you like or not <laughs> And then you put cream on the top and I've got chocolate sprinkles and some other beautiful sprinkles. Good afternoon, Heavy Metal Mark. So I'm just going to try some of this wonderful trifle. Oh, that is very nice sound. And I'm going to see if I can get it to slip in the dish at the angle that you may be able to see some of the levels. Oh, just lost a bit at the side. Mmm. <laughs> so I'm just trying to see if I can get to show you some of the sponge. It's got sponge in the bottom. So, let me have a go. I've got a lovely brand new spoon I got yesterday. Mmm. Oh, that's nice. I can taste that sherry. I got a bit, bit excited with the sherry. Good morning, young David. Mm. Thomas Shelby, thanks for popping in. Mmm. <laughs> oh, that is gorgeous. And the sherry is rather scrumptious, plus the raspberries. Mmm. Oh, I could eat lots of that. <coughs> So that's homemade trifle. I will put the recipes on, on from the wartime cookbook. Welcome Dale. Afternoon tea on this beautiful sunny day. So today is VE Day. And VE Day was in 1945, the end of World War II. And we should celebrate these things. We should celebrate every single celebration to do with ending of any war, particularly. But I like to celebrate 
the World War II particularly because my father was in World War II. Thanks, Thomas. And as well this week, it was his birthday too, and he would have been 99. It's a shame he didn't get anywhere near that. He only got to 72, which is nothing really, is it? But he survived the war. He had a wonderful marriage to my mother for many, many years. And life was good, so you cannot complain at all. So today I've made a trifle for VE Day for celebration. This is the sort of thing you would have cooked and made and baked on VE Day. You would have had street parties, bunting. I'm going to see if I can show you any of my lovely bunting. I'll do a little twirl and show you. Thanks very much. Let me see if I can get the bunting in. I, it was too high to get it in earlier. Look, I've got some beautiful bunting I put up. Isn't that fantastic? I love it. Ooh. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. I'm glad you like the dress. <laughs> so, shall we have a go with this cake and see what happens? I'm dying to eat the rest of this. Mmm. <laughs> so, let's have a go with the cake and see... Now, you know what will happen? You can foresee it's going to happen that the cream will ooze out. But that's usually part of the charm. I have to say, I was very, very impressed with the cake making. It's just here, that trifle there. I'm just going to throw a little raspberry over there. Just try not to get this cream to sort of jump out and leap out. There we are, beautiful. Look at that. Now even I have to say that's pretty impressive. For the, it's the first time I've cooked um, a Victoria sponge cake in my oven here. So I'm very, very impressed that sort of come out as impressively as it has to be on it. So I better try it. I'm trying it on your behalf, so bear with me. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, wonderful. and a little bit of sherry in those raspberries. Wonderful. Oh, I missed some of that, Martin. It went so quick, I couldn't see it. I wish they'd slow down with taking the um, comments off. It seems to roll very, very quickly. <laughs> oh, I see. I can just see a reflection. I was trying to think what it was. It's got the reflection of what's written on the banner. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, I'm trying it, Peter. Don't you worry. Yeah, I can tell you it's absolutely awful. I'm so pleased you can't have nail art. <laughs> Let me get another piece of cake. Mm. Oh, Dale, I'm glad you're here. Thanks for uh, popping in. So, Victoria sponge cake. Look at this. Mm -mm. Welcome from Turkey. So I've got Victorian sponge cake, I've got homemade trifle and a lovely pot of tea. If I could send it in the post, Dale, I would love to. And they would have made homemade sausage rolls, Victoria, um, Victory, uh, what else would they have made? Um, Scotch eggs, and there was so much homemade sandwiches. Everybody would have pitched in, everybody would have come to celebrate um, for VE Day. So that's what I'm doing on this Sunday afternoon in this beautiful sunny weather. 
Oh, it'd be so fun to have everybody here for a party, wouldn't it? Junior, welcome. Thanks very much. Thanks for popping in today. Well, I put the um, the latest Saturday bra trying on, and um, that's on um, this channel, Annabelle's Adventures. And there's also a new top that I was gifted by Lace Lingerie and that's on the original Annabelle. So there's quite a bit gone on. There's also um, the festival to come that I went to on Thursday. I'm just editing that today. Hey there, Martin. Oh, you could have been here for a party on VE Day. So there's quite a bit gone on this week. On Tuesday, I'm in central Amsterdam for the day. I'm going to do some filming in Amsterdam. So how exciting will that be? Mmm. Oh, I'm just nibbling this cake here. Oh, it's got raspberries and cream, and I'm making it a mess, really. Mmm. Oh, beautiful sponge cake. Very, very impressed with that. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I think you should. You definitely need some cake, a little trifle, and enjoy yourself. Dress up. Great, thanks, Kenny. Thanks for popping in. So, lots more things to come. There's some swimwear videos to come, ready for my holiday. There's a packing video to come. How am I going to get it all in the case? Video. And... What else is to come? Obviously, um, Amsterdam for the day. Um, out and about this week, this coming week, it's going to be very warm. There could be a boat trip coming up this week. There's definitely a couple of trips out for the day. And uh, lots more to come and video soon. Away from uh, a week or so in June. Um, part of that is in the southeast of England. So I will be filming and doing lots with that. Well, let me stand, do a little twirl. I'm drinking tea, absolutely. That's what you drink in a teapot. <laughs> let me see if I can get you in a good position for me to do a little twirl for you. <sighs> oh, and it'll be, it will be a little G and T, maybe later on, a little polka dot dress. Ooh. <laughs> Let me just turn you just a little bit and then hopefully we can get me all in. Somebody's just asked for a full. It's because it's this way, it's much cheesier on YouTube. There we are. One red and white polka dot dress ready, all set for afternoon tea. Well, my feet are here in my lovely little pumps from Gabor, these beautiful little pumps. Doo -doo. I'm afraid you can't get everything in on YouTube, I'm afraid. Hey there, thanks very much for popping in and joining me for afternoon tea with this lovely bunting. We've got cake, we've got trifle. <laughs> oh, I'm taking it out with me later on this afternoon. It will be eaten, don't you worry. <laughs> I won't be eating it all. No, I'm sharing it this afternoon. Right, let me finish my tea and then I'm popping on to Instagram. So if you want to come have an Instagram live, you're very welcome to as well. Hey there from Canada. Thank you very much, Chris. A trifling matter. Oh, you're so good. I might change the name to that. Yeah, don't get yourself in a trifle. <laughs> Well, thank you very much for joining me here on VE Day, celebrating end of World War II and really celebrating life in general because it's a lovely sunny day. And I look forward to seeing you all very, very soon. You have a rest of a lovely weekend. Bye for now. I'm going on Instagram right now, Peter. See you all soon. Bye for now.